Within the research project 3DVis, we developed a 3D visualization software that we can use to visualize or demonstrate construction plans um, to the public, to decision makers and also urban planners who need to communicate with the public in order to present their plans and to, to make them um, understandable to the public. Within the project we make use of a new tool, the multi-touch table, which offers on the one hand 3D visualization functionality and also a very intuitive interface which allows moderators during a public presentation for example to on the one hand speak to the public and on the other hand um, work with the system and with a 3D visualization at the same time. The tool is mostly used by urban planners and decision makers to present their ideas and their um, construction plans to the public. And the main advantage of, is, of this is that the public gets an understanding of, of how the constructions work and how, and, and, and how the plans are, um, so that um, they can understand the reason behind certain decisions um, in the construction plans. Museums are great in storytelling through the assets they use and the way they present them. And storytelling is becoming more and more important tool in digital media. The research project CHESS aims to enrich a museum wizard with an interactive and personalized storytelling where we focus on the augmented reality. In CHESS we use the so-called video see-through effect to show, for instance, the statue Artemis in her original bright colors. While watching, we can follow audio narrations that are virtually spread around her and let her talk for herself. To create such experiences we use our instant AR framework. It combines our computer vision engine with all the knowledge we have from the research in that field with extended web technologies. With that it makes the process of creating such AR applications more or less as easy as creating websites and it also simplifies the development process for both the developers that create the applications and the curators that want to use it to present their content.